Now the next bit of the interface that we're going to talk about are the tool shelves. And the tool shelves are an amazingly efficient and fast and intuitive way to do an awful lot uh, in Maya. This is, uh, is something you're probably going to get really uh, happy about having here. Uh, how much time it's going to save you as, as you start intuitively getting to know what you want to actually add to to a scene. So uh, here they are. And uh, there's a bunch of different ones. This general one, well, maybe doesn't make a lot of sense quite yet, but certainly the polygons one does. These, uh, these objects, these tools on the left, basically the same thing as we have in these create polygon primitives over here that uh, here let's just delete this uh, cone come into these tools and boom there it is so recreate just as quick as you want and then come over here do whatever just like you uh, created it elsewhere now a number of these others we haven't really uh, talked about what goes on in these yet one you will be familiar with already is this rendering one here. Now, rendering contains a number of different things. One of the most uh, familiar at this point will be some of these materials that you can select. So we've got our Blin and our Fong and our Lambert and a couple of others. And then uh, we've got our rendering uh, clapboards here. Those are in buttons just above. So those are maybe not quite as... Uh, valuable but but certainly the uh, the material ones are now one other thing you can do is actually to create custom tabs and you can have lots of tabs out here you probably won't create that many but you'll probably create a few and uh, once you create a custom tab you can move it around the interface you can put whatever tools you want on it and uh, move those around and take them off and put them on and uh, and just just go crazy and we'll be doing quite a bit of that in a few chapters when we start doing some uh, more sophisticated modeling and I think uh, I think you'll be very happy with what you can do with that so that's it for now and we'll see you in the next video